Picture the Roaring Twenties, an era of prosperity, cultural dynamism, and the birth of luxury cruise liners. This was a time of economic expansion, where newfound wealth and technological innovation paved the way for the creation of grand, opulent cruise ships. The Twenties saw astounding advancements in shipbuilding technology. These developments allowed for the creation of vessels which not only transported passengers from one port to another, but did so with an unprecedented level of luxury and comfort. Traveling on these ships was an experience like no other. Passengers were treated to lavish interiors, reminiscent of the grandest hotels of the era. Gourmet dining was the norm, with menus crafted by world-renowned chefs. And the entertainment? Simply world-class, with renowned musicians, dancers, and performers gracing the stages on board. As the world was about to plunge into economic depression, the cruise ship industry was at its peak, offering a glimpse into a world of unparalleled luxury. As the world grappled with the Great Depression, the cruise ship industry faced its own challenges. The Roaring Twenties had given way to an era of economic despair, and this downturn didn't spare the luxury of cruise ships. Companies were forced to adapt or sink, and adapt they did by offering more affordable options to a wider range of passengers. The allure of cruise ships didn't wane though, in fact for many, they offered a welcome escape from the harsh realities of life on land. These floating cities became bastions of hope, their opulent interiors a stark contrast to the bleakness of the world beyond their hulls. The 1930s saw a democratization of cruise travel. The ship's deck, once the exclusive playground of the elite, was now accessible to the common man. Despite the economic hardships of the time, the cruise ship industry managed to keep its course, offering a beacon of hope and escape. In the aftermath of World War II, the cruise ship industry experienced a renaissance. The world, it seemed, had caught its breath and was ready to explore again. The post-war economic boom breathed new life into the industry, and luxury travel, which had been somewhat dormant during the war years, resurged with a vengeance. The 1950s witnessed the creation of even more opulent ships. These floating palaces were furnished with lavish interiors, gourmet restaurants, and entertainment venues that rivaled their land-based counterparts. It was a golden age of extravagance on the high seas, with cruise lines vying for the title of the most luxurious vessel. But the 1950s weren't just about opulence. This era also marked the dawn of a new era in global travel. Cruise lines began to introduce a variety of exotic destinations into their itineraries the Caribbean, the Mediterranean, and even the far-flung corners of the South Pacific were now just a cruise away. These new routes opened up a world of possibility for travelers, making cruise ships a popular choice for those seeking adventure beyond their own borders. Indeed, the 1950s were transformative years for the cruise ship industry. It was a decade when the world's love affair with ocean travel was rekindled, and the industry responded by providing experiences that were more luxurious and diverse than ever before. As the world entered a new era of prosperity, so too did the cruise ship industry, reaching new heights of luxury and adventure. The dawn of the jet age brought new challenges and opportunities for the cruise ship industry. The 1960s saw the introduction of commercial jet travel, a development that threatened to overshadow the grandeur of ocean voyages. The world was shrinking, and the cruise ship industry needed to adapt to this rapidly changing landscape. But rather than succumb to the speed of the jet plane, cruise lines doubled down on what made them unique. They understood that their appeal lay not just in the destination, but the journey itself. So the industry began to focus on amplifying the onboard experience. More than just a mode of transportation, cruise ships became floating cities, offering a plethora of leisure activities. From glamorous casinos and world-class dining to extravagant shows and state-of-the-art fitness centers, cruise ships were transformed into a one-stop shop for luxury and relaxation. This period also saw cruise ships evolve into symbols of opulence. They were no longer just about getting from point A to point B, but about the experience of travel itself. The allure of sipping a cocktail while gazing at the endless ocean, or dressing for a formal dinner, was an experience that air travel couldn't replicate. As the world became more connected, the cruise ship industry adapted, offering a unique blend of opulence and adventure that continues to captivate travelers to this day.